nataka kwaeleza leo hii kwamba na hii sauti sikiki manake governor angelikuwa hata kishushe unaona tunanyima hata collect sess titanium ya kwale so na collect sess kitu kwamba tunaambiwa tufuate royalties governor ana pesa gani mpaka na sisi tukulate tu, tupate hiyo royalty tupate sess tupate ndio angalau tuna pesa maendeleo let's be sincere turkana wanapata 25% ya mafuta yao kweli uongo sasa kama wamepoa 25% walishikana senator, MCAs, governor, MPs wakaenda wakalala barabarani wiki nzima. Walipewa mafuta wakupewa? Walipewa 25%. Those are billions. Lakini ukija Masai Mara so wanapata yao. Masai Mara game reserve wanapata yao. Je, sisi taita tapeta tutapata nini kwa sababu East and West? Bali tumeambiwa kwamba hii ni national cake. National cake. That's stupidity. National cake yani sisi taita taveta mturkana anapata yake peke yake haganyi taita ya taita igawanye masai na pia mturkana hiyo ni fair jamani that is double standards so the same government tunataendelea na haya kweli lakini hatuna hela ya kutosha we are endowed with everything mining is not devolved governor na uwezo wote anarusha rusha ngumi yeye anajaribu lakini hana uwezo wote yeah tuseme ukweli kitu kwamba KWS haiko devolved hata ndovu zikiingia kiasi gani governor atafanya nini kubweka bweka ukienda pale sengine afungiwe gate wanasema wanatambua mbunge peke yake so let's be sincere in our hearts na tuweke lawama ambapo pale ina style bwana governor uh, mimi nashukuru a budget ndio hii tunangojea tu na nataka kuambia hivi kwa on source revenue ushuru wetu hapa hapa juzi tulieka target ya 300 tulichokuwa zaidi paka tukafika 332 lakini ugonjwa umeingia jamani. So don't expect much. We are trying. Lakini nataka kuweka leo kwamba governor ameruhusiwa na sheria na waziri. Tulimezumza kwa urefu. Lakini wakati sheria saingine iko very fun. Inakufungia nyumba kabisa alafu inaacha pali tu upate ka oxygen. Hii sheria PFM Act imeruhusu wafanyikazi wote taita taveta, wafanyabiashara wote kama kina mama mboga. Kama wana association yao na wamefinyika sana watume wale officials wao waje kwa waziri wa finance waziri aende kwa governor inaruhusiwa na PFM act inaruhusiwa na sheria governor anaweza waive anaweza waachilia awambie jamani msilipe kitu paka mwezi wa kumi. so governor tumeelewana naye kwamba hata waive sahihi lakini wale wamezidiwa kabisa msije nyote aturuhusiwe kuja watu wengi lakini wananchi wanaweza kete wafanyabiashara fulani kama mmeamua ni association fulani muje kwa governor mfunguliwe paka siku ile kutapatikana afueni alafu ndio tuanze kuchukua ushuru. Asante Your Excellency. Today we've made history by being if not the first part of the first counties to sign their budget for the financial year 2020-2021. And I think that is something we cannot take for granted. Uh, na natumai tunaona uh, habari ya kwamba several counties have found themselves in in turmoil because ya uh, maswala ya bajeti lakini taita taveta county your excellency today we are among the first if not the first county in this republic of kenya to witness the signing of our budget yangu ni kumshukuru mheshimiwa governor kushukuru uh, uh, the, the management of uh, county assembly kujitolea maana tulijitolea tukaketi na tukasema ya kwamba matatizo yote yale ambayo yalitukumba mwaka uliopita hatuyataki this uh, this time round ama huu mwaka na tumeketi tumeelewana na ndiposa leo tuko hapa this afternoon to witness this uh, uh, this occasion whereby our our governor his excellency uh, granton samboja will be signing the, the the budget and also the appropriation bill which was passed yesterday and i'm grateful to the county assembly because mulijitolea tuliketi mahali kulikuwa na utata tulijadiliana that willingness that ability ya kwamba kusema our county comes first and that is the leadership of our governor Granton Samboja that is what he told us ketini muelewane where there are issues i on them out and let us have a unified budget because at the end of the day the county assembly and uh, the county executive are joined by the budget So yangu sitaki kuongea mengi yangu ni kuwashukuru leadership ya county assembly uh, asanteni sana because we've worked as a team for the purpose 
and the goodwill of this county. Asante ni sana. Mheshimiwa uh, governor wetu Granton Samboja kwa kutupatia mwelekeo. And that is what we call leadership. Kwa sababu alituita akatuambia Yes, on any given day there are issues with the budget, but can you sit down as leaders of this county, as people who are charged with the responsibility of, of, of leading this county? Tafadhali, tengeze any budget, na ndiyo hiyo tunashukuru ya kwamba imepitishwa na appropriation bill. Sisi kwa kauli moja, governor wetu, waziri wetu, wafeza, na baraza la mawaziri kwa ujumla na county assembly kwa kauli moja tumeamua budget even the budget it's about the county number one. number two is about the county so that vile tumeharakisha kupitisha county assembly na vile waziri aliharakisha kuileta county assembly all the way to the implementation level umesikia governor kisema hapa kwamba by december mambo ya budget miradi eh, implementation ya budget itakuwa imekamilika ili mwaka ujao yawe ni mengine eh, tunaenda notch haya kwa sababu gani wakesho mwadime na mcheku Eh? They want to see results. They want to see results. What are we doing? What are we in office for? So kando na kwamba budget in its ambitious way. Yeah, we have planned, we have approved, it has been ascended. Execution will be in equally, you know, in an ambitious way. Can we have results? That is what Mwadime Okesho and Bako and Mcheku are looking up to. And we want to give them nothing less because they expect nothing less from us. Asante ni sana, tutazidi kuongea. Nataka nimalizie kwa kusema kwamba sasa ndiyo kazi imeaza. And as I've promised and I'm promising wanainchi wa county hii. Budget hii tunaenda kuianza immediately and take my word to the bank. By December, miradi yote itakuwa imekamilika. <laughs> Mwisho, nataka niombe umoja wa viongozi wote. Haijalishi uko wapi. Kinachojalisha ni kwamba umoja wetu ndio utapeleka taita taveta mbele. Kama ni mambo ya kura, I keep on saying, 2022 will come and go. Lakini wananchi wetu, kila kuchao, kilio chao kitakuwa ni maendeleo. Kwa sasa tuwache tofauti za siyasa, let us combine efforts zetu sisi sote. Sisi na assembly tumeonyesha ishara leo. Na kuna mengi tumeongea leo kutoka asubuhi. Sisi ni kuwaomba muone vile tutafanya kazi. Tunaomba pia umoja wa wabunge wa county hii because kuna issues zile zilizoko juu. Lazima kuwe na sauti yao alafu ya county ambayo ni mimi na maimsie. Senator Pia will keep on working together. So tumeweka mikakati ya kutosha. The only thing I'll urge wananchi kutoka kila sehemu. Atutaki swala la boundary liwe ni mambo ya vita. Tunataka kila kitu kiende kwa amani na waziri wa fedha ninajua umeweka mikakati ya kutosha na kuna ofisi mtitondei inaenda kufunguliwa ili hii financial ya tukusanye ushuru wetu wa pale mtitondei mahali mpaka inajulikana ilikuwa kutoka enzi hizo za zamani mwisho nimalizie kulikuwa na changamoto za madawa kwa mahospitali because kemsa pia ilikuwa imelemewa na mzigo wakati wa corona 
kila oda zenye zilikuwa pale zilikuwa zimekwama kwa sababu pia wamekuwa kishulikia na mambo ya corona ya kusupply zile madawa na equipment zenye zinakuwa ordered but yesterday madawa yetu yamekuja na ninajua yameanza kusambazwa kwa mahospitali tafadhali zoezi hilo limalizwe haraka sana ili wananchi wasiendelee kuumia god bless you taita taveta isonge mbele sote tushirikiane tubadilishe taita yetu haitajengwa na mtu mwingine isipokuwa sisi asanteni